Imagine a world where the catastrophic conflicts of the 20th century might have been averted, where the term world war might have remained ominously absent from our history books. This is the tantalizing possibility that hovers over us as we ponder. What if the League of Nations had been successful? Established in the aftermath of World War I, the League of Nations was born out of a collective longing for peace that echoed across the war-torn landscapes of the world. It was a vision of hope and unity, a daring attempt to ensure that no generation would ever again face the horrors witnessed between 1914 and 1918. But what if this noble endeavor had not foundered on the rocks of international politics? What if it had succeeded in its lofty goals? The immediate benefit, it's reasonable to assume, would have been the prevention of World War II. This very idea sends chills down one's spine. The thought of a world spared from the devastating loss of life, the unspeakable atrocities, and the lasting scars left on humanity is overwhelmingly poignant. The Holocaust, the nuclear bombings of Hiroshima and Nagasaki, the countless lives lost and the families torn apart, could all have been relegated to the realm of the unimaginable. Moreover, consider the geopolitical landscape of such a world. Without World War II, the Cold War might have never materialized. The ideological divide that defined the latter half of the 20th century, pitting capitalism against communism, East against West, could have been significantly less pronounced if it existed at all. The arms race, the brinkmanship, the proxy wars that took so many lives in Korea, Vietnam, and across Africa, might have been relegated to a less prominent role in international relations. Beyond preventing specific conflicts, if the League of Nations had succeeded, it would have fundamentally transformed the structure of international politics. A successful League would have meant a world where international law and collective action took precedence over unilateral moves and national interest. The sovereignty of nations would have been balanced with a global commitment to peace and mutual respect, potentially leading to a more equitable distribution of resources and wealth across the globe. Economically, a world where the League of Nations triumphed might have seen a reduction in military expenditures, freeing up resources for social programs, education, and health care, leading to a significant improvement in global quality of life. The cooperative ethos that would have underpinned a successful League could have fostered innovation and technological advancement, propelling humanity into a more prosperous future. However, it's also critical to acknowledge the shadows that linger around the edges of this what-if scenario. Success for the League of Nations might have required compromises and concessions that could have entrenched colonialism and unequal power dynamics in more subtle but equally pernicious ways. The peace achieved might have been a fragile one, constantly threatened by the unaddressed undercurrents of nationalism and imperialism. In a world where the League of Nations had been successful, we might have been gifted with peace, but we must wonder at what cost. Would the victory of a collective over the individual nation states have led to a world less colorful, less diverse in thought and culture? Or would it have paved the way for a truly global community united in its diversity and strengthened by its common commitment to the greater good. The League of Nations represents a path not taken, a dream unfulfilled. Yet, in pondering its potential success, we are reminded of the enduring power of hope and the perpetual quest for peace. Its failure teaches us invaluable lessons about the complexities of international relations and the challenges of achieving lasting peace. But its ambition inspires us to never cease striving for a world where conflict is resolved, not on the battlefield, but around the table of brotherhood, understanding, and mutual respect. To imagine a successful League of Nations is to imagine a world that could have been, a world that still could be.